life of a double shifter. This is what I have to do, guys. I gotta carry this darn ladder all around. Make my little way to the treehouse, you know? This is where I go. This is where I live. Hopefully I won't die doing this. But if I die, you guys are gonna be the witness. So, up here is where I sleep. My humble abode. And then I just rest that thingy on the floor and sleep. I have an hour to sleep. I gotta make that moolah, you know what I'm saying? This guy wants me to snap from dancing, so cover your eyes, kid. Guys, it's going down. Look how pretty it is. And I'm by myself. So this is going to be weird going to Ipsy by myself the first time. I just got my hair all fluffed up and there's so much people here, guys. It's freaking crazy. Wow, I hear myself delayed. This is kind of weird. God, guys, there's like bubbles everywhere. It's amazing. I'm trying to like step out, but it's so beautiful. Guys, I can't carry anymore. And this is mostly free stuff. It's crazy. I don't know. I'm just gonna line up and get as much. I got free cotton candy. It matches my hair. Um, I'm thinking of going to two of the longest lines. So Nyx is one of them, and they're giving away a free palette apparently. I didn't know if you guys caught that, but they're giving away a free palette. So, I'm gonna do that right now. Hashtag glow getter. I got a glow kit. Oh my gosh, this is like the best feeling ever. It's like trick or treating, but makeup style. Last line of the day. I don't know what I'm gonna get. But look at that cute ass cover girl. Finally home, guys. Finally home. The buns are still popping and not expired yet. Like, look at all my free shirt. Oh my god. My favorite is right here. Look at her. My favorite is. You from Kentucky? Cause you are finger licking good. Wow, fail of the day is when I just rambled on for hours. Okay, I'm exaggerating. Rambled on and then I wasn't even recording. Anyways, good afternoon, strangers. Long story short, I'm cat sitting Alex's kitty, which is Kiwi. Um, if you guys don't know and you guys are new subscribers, Kiwi is a cat that came to visit me for like 10 days straight. I lived with Quang, so uh, she kept visiting me. And then one day I just felt like, you know what, I really love this cat. So then um, Quang found somebody to take care of her until they couldn't take care of her anymore. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna ask Alex, who is the next crazy cat person I know in my life. So now Alex has her and named her Luxie, which I'm like, mm, I like Kiwi better. But I'm cat sitting her for a week. I'm so excited. Just changed my sheets to like my old sheets, which is this one right here. It still matches my room, which is fine, but it's a, not a duvet, it's a comforter. And then now I can have her sleep on my bed but until then yeah just gonna have her chill here and then I can't wait to just vlog with her around it's gonna be so cute and I'm trying to be better at like you know being a better version of myself every day um, as you know ever since I started moving here I try to be more in touch with who I am inside I know that sounds really weird but um, you know when you move on your own and you start fresh you start to think oh man like what can I do to do better, right? So, yeah. I'm thinking of putting my other tapestry in the living room because literally it's just chilling here and on my chair. So I feel like I can get better usage of it if I were to put it out. So I will show you guys that later if I end up putting it up. And then I'm also going to go to the gym today. I've been trying to go to the gym when I can. I'm not going to like stress about it and be like, oh my god, I have to go to the gym today. I have to go to the gym today. I'm more trying to take a casual approach to it, like if I have time, which I do today, go to the gym. Um, I've gone to the gym in my building, like I like to say five times now, and so far it's pretty good. Like I just do my own thing on the treadmill. I'm not really looking towards like 
bodybuilding yet or toning yet until I lose some weight. But until then, can't wait to see how the day unfolds. But Kiwi is going to be here in 12 hours. It's 12.56 p.m. and she's going to be here at midnight. So super excited and yeah, super excited. So I ended up putting the tapestry in my room just because there was like a couple wall scratches that was bothering me. But oh my gosh, I love it. It looks so pretty, especially like that. And then I'm going to have like some little frames there. But I think it looks so cool. I love it. If you guys are wondering where I got this from, it's from Society6. It would look better if it showed the whole picture, so I might actually move this mirror frame here. So then when I put the little frames around it, it'll look more symmetrical. But what do you guys think? And there's the other one. Love it. It's so beautiful. Oh my god, guys, look, it's a rat! I kind of feel bad for it. I know it's gross and all, but it's so cute. If I was a rat lover, I would so help it out. I hope it's okay. It looks like it's still breathing. And it doesn't look dirty, so I'm wondering. Oh my gosh, guys. I just ran on the treadmill for like 30, 40 minutes. And then I did the elliptical. I think that's what it's called. That thing where it looks like you're skiing and your feet is like in a biking motion. I don't know what it's called, but I think it's an elliptical. I could be wrong. Uh, for another 30 minutes, so... Yeah, I feel like I did justice. Um, it's funny because, you know, people are trying to get the summer body, but I'm just trying to get that lifetime goal of being healthier, being happier for myself, you know, because I noticed that I have gained a little, well, okay, I've gained weight over the past couple of years after moving into Toronto. So I'm trying to get back into the swing of working out and doing things for me. So, hmm. I'm drinking, um, this tea concoction that I made, it's with strawberry lemonade and I think orange. It's pretty good. Pretty good on its own. Look at Louis Vuitton's new thing. It's so pretty. I guess it flips when this side gets heavy or something, but that's so pretty. Ooh. Hello, strangers. So I'm with Turks. He's bringing me out. We went on like a little mini hike. It wasn't even a hike, it probably a stroll. I tried skateboarding and I can't do it. I I really want to try to be good, but it's just something about it. It scares me. My balance goes way off. And this guy's pretty good at skateboarding for a new. But we're in Pickering Town Center. Haven't I don't think we've been here before. Doesn't look I don't know. Doesn't look familiar. But I might go to Lush in this one. I think there's a papyrus here too. I could be wrong. But. I don't know what today is going to unfold. We're just relaxing on massage chairs for now until we find like a place to eat or something. No? Nothing? One of the things I like hanging out with this guy is because we can spend hours huh? in aisles. If I ask anybody else, they'll be like, nah. What are you talking about? We can spend hours in any aisle or in any store. Oh, you mean I'll now get bored? I'm going to chow in mine. Yeah, like this is what me and Lena do too. Just go in stores and go through each aisle. Not that we need anything, but I'm telling you guys, the dollar store is stepping up their stuff. The moment when you wake up mad early to get ready only to find out that your plans failed. I'm annoyed slightly, but I'm not that pissed off just because I have other stuff to do today anyways. So yeah, on my eyes, I'm using... I used a mixture of the Le Grand Palais palette from Too Faced. I love this palette. It's very versatile. You can do like warm colors to cool. I'm not sure if you guys seen it before. Let me show you. And I suck at vlogging with one hand. I haven't been vlogging in a while because I've been so busy with work, but this is basically how the palette looks like, but I love how there's like fun colors plus um, warm colors, and I think there's only two, four, yeah, 
four or five matte shades. The rest are like kind of sparkly. And I've also used it in conjunction with the modern renaissance which i'm sure you guys know how that looks like but yeah today i'm supposed to meet up with nancy because yesterday was her birthday but then at the same time uh, she's doing her own thing right now as well so i'm thinking of either as much as i want to take a nap and just sleep my life away at the moment i want to use this opportunity and just do errands and go to the gym I know, and it sucks. I hate going to the gym with, like, makeup because, to me, it feels so, like, you know, it feels so sweaty and icky. I don't like it, but it is what it is. I didn't put any, um, like, highlighters or contour, so it won't feel as clogged here, which is fine. But my eye area, I can't, like, wipe off if I'm sweating or something. Pupil on the same road, but I might pick this one up. And it smells exactly like green tea. If you guys don't know, I love green tea stuff. Alright, so here's the deep fried combo platter. And we're gonna try it with some sauce. There's some sauces over here. I want to get some groceries, but then at the same time, the other food festivals only open for another hour. So, oh my gosh, guys, look at how cute! Look at how cute this is! Oh, it's the puzzle! Yeah. Look, it's so good. Oh, they have cocos here too. Hey 
guys so the festivals were so fun i'm so glad that i went with nancy because like overall the whole day literally i was just eating i ate from like 4 30 until 11 30 which is horrible like we ate little finger foods but i wanted to show you guys what i bought from like the different booths okay so basically i went to this little gift shop i think i've shown you guys this on the um vlog but this is a little green tea soap it's so tiny but it smells exactly like matcha green tea so i'm excited to use this i'm probably just gonna put it on display somewhere for now just because i like how cute it looks it's so adorable and then i also got these pins for my lush apron and it's from a company called um bon flare and it says here that she is in markham so I'm going to write the information down below, but she was so sweet. Her name was Lucille, and I felt like she was so passionate about her items, so I was happy to support her. And I also got this really, really cute-ass ring. Like, I can't show you guys the detail of it, but when I wear it, I will show it to you in another vlog. But it's so cute because it's like a thread ring, and then at the back, there's that little pearl that hangs at the back. It's really, really cute. And then... I also checked out this place, um, Nui Garden, which is super cute too. Um, they can customize your order in terms of like your succulents. Um, I wanted a specific succulent because, you know, I have the spiky one. I also have the little cacti one, so I didn't want to overload it too much, but <sighs> they were really cute succulents for cheap. So, I mean, I kind of regret not getting one, but at the same time, my hands were really full, but... Do check those out i'll write the description down below but really really cool so it's the one in my middle finger but look at how cute and dainty that is it's so cute and then the back there's like a little pearl ah i'm so happy and me and nancy got like matchy ones but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed my vlog in terms of like the whole festival sorry i wasn't so verbal on it i was literally like my hands were full half the time with food and like all that other stuff so um it was just so fun and i wish i could have vlogged more of the gift shops but i totally respect it when it's their own company and you know they don't want their stuff to be recorded so that i get but oh, it was so fun and i can't wait to go to the next festival that's nearby